fans certainly have a right to complain. Yeah. Might have been there a fraction early. Boy, there's holding, no doubt about that. Baz is sacked. The one thing you talk about any time that you have a pass rusher, and I tell this to young kids and high school kids that are defensive linemen, always work on your get off. Baz is sacked again. It's very difficult to handle as Kelly can't get out of his stance and Okafor is off like a rocket. K-State, third and ten, a blitz. Bears taken down. Any type of strange move, it's just pure speed with a little dip, making himself skinny and is able to finish. Pass and run for one. Cody Bass. Under duress and buried again. Had time to at least throw it away. Yard line, seventh sack of the night for Texas. They had bracket coverage on that means they took care of Wheaton and Cooks downfield with corners and safeties. It's 198 pounds. Play fake. He's in trouble and buried back at the 31. Now for Hamlet. Baz running out of time and tackle. The running back goes down and blocks Okafor. Right there. He's out. I come. That's a good job of executing the defense. They come after him with a five-man rush and he's sacked. With a chance to tie or take the lead on their next possession. Baz, nowhere to go. Four wide receivers. Four-man rush. Baz, sacked again. Stood in there and got popped. Anticipation, exactly what Cody Baz did. Mates two in the turnover battle, or better. Look out, Baz just did get it off in the two yards of offense at the 228 in the first half. Mother. They faked it the storm. Cody Vaz lost the football as he wound up the throw. He the horns did. Reed, the other defensive end, appeared to recover it. See Okafor, we highlighted him. I like the fact that he's not going to make the sack, but he has the awareness to swat the football away. Backer in, weak side linebacker tonight. Vaz straight back. And another ball thrown up for grabs. Quandre Diggs has it. Interception. Makes his cut, which allows Quandre Diggs with excellent closing speed to finish. Trying to set up a screen, and it's intercepted. He does, keeps a good job of his eyes on the quarterback. Closes on his man-to-man -man coverage. And for the NFL. Storm Woods bounced off the pile. Seven bowl game in ten years. Stint two for Riley. Incomplete pass. Short drop and almost another. Game plan is to have Kenny Vaccaro help out on Wheaton and Brandon Cooks. Right there, you see the catch of the year for Wheaton. He's one shy of their single season record. Dangerous throw by Baz, and Cooks gets swung down 59 yards. Wound up with two touchdowns on those four possessions. And then that is a curse is to overanalyze everything you do. The Alamo Dome, they come here every summer and enjoy the Guadalupe River. He's had just one carry in this quarter. The light of his friends and relatives here, welcoming back the native Texan. Now deep with Cooks and Wheaton, both to the right of Vaz, who's still the quarterback. Still sacks. Loss of six. Karan Ward. By their own 44. It looked like Vaccaro might have been offside. No flag now. Storm. Baz is from Lodi, California. He gave it off to Storm Woods. You're going to read. Back and healthy and playing at a high level this year. Woods gang tackled him to the inexperienced at linebacker. Trying to set up a screen again. Barred by Baz. And very few positives. You know, that's a completion, but way short of the first down. ADS talked about how Okafor and Vicaro, the only seniors on the two deep in the defense, have really taken over a leadership role. Both with their words and their play. Yeah, and, and it's good to see for them being seniors. And regardless of what team anybody plays, their, your last game you want to play well. And Alex Okafor is playing a whale of a football game, but he's being helped by Oregon State. Ash deep for Marquise Goodwin. Touchdown and the lead for Texas. Corners is going to get caught peeking. And as we said earlier, if Goodwin gets even with you, he's leaving you. We are in field goal range to make it a one-score game. Ash in trouble. Got away for the moment. Throws down the sideline for a touchdown. David Ash made some big plays here in the second half. Well, 
two seniors on the defensive depth chart. Some trickery. Here comes Marquise Goodwin, the Olympic athlete. Touchdown. Well, the bad penalty did ignite the Longhorn. Did Oregon State very quickly turned into a touchdown. Rose short, caught, first down. Marquise Goodwin spun away. First team consensus All-American in Oregon State history. Ash throws again confidently. About timing and throwing a guy open and throwing to a spot. Ash, great catch by Shipley. On a He's showing a big time catch right here. Not only the ability to turn his hips, but bring it down with one hand. Ash got hit as he throws, and it's still caught. On third down and 13, Ash throws deep. Only a three-man rush and a receiver open. That's what we've seen so far tonight. Play fake by Ash. And he throws. Decision making process easier for Ash. He zips one. David Ash on second and ten. Has a man, Mike Davis. And catches for Shipley. That one good for 14 yards. Mike Davis again. DJ Monroe went in motion. Ash setting up a screen to the near side to Jonathan Gray. Tackles in 20. DJ Monroe. Looked like a design run again. Leaping into the end zone. Touchdown, David Ash and Texas. Major Applewhite said job one, first night calling the play is getting Goodwin more involved.